Hi, Chet Hastings from One Click Learning. Have you ever inserted a new image into a WordPress page or post and then found to your dismay when you got to that page or post that it had an ugly gray border around it? Well, in this short video, I'm going to show you two quick methods for removing that border. Let me show you a quick example of what I mean. You insert an image uh, using the insert an image icon and it puts code in and then when you visit the page you'll see that you've got an image it looks fine in the editor here but let's update that and then go look at the page and see what the uh, final image looks like when we update the page and go out to the uh, website itself or the blog itself and take a look at it you can see that it's surrounded by this gray image which kind of distracts from the whole layout so what we need to do is get rid of this, and uh, I'm going to show you a quick method to do that. The first method uh, is an automatic method to remove uh, that border, and uh, to accomplish that, click on the image, and then on this little image or icon right here, this is an, uh, an edit icon, click on it. then click on advanced settings and when that page opens you'll see a border and an empty box put a zero in there and then scroll down and click on update and that will automatically remove the border now for some reason maybe a theme you're using or an older version of WordPress whatever it is if that's not working or if you're just the kind of person that likes to do things the manual uh, way I'll show you another tip here that you can uh, do accomplish the same thing by just inserting a short snippet of code keep in mind that this uh, border image uh, issue is something that's caused by the theme itself not by WordPress and uh, most properly designed themes will have eliminated this but if you have found a theme that you're happy with and you don't want to change the theme you want to stay with the same theme and you're faced with this problem either the first method or the second method will, will solve the problem for you now this second method involves placing a little snippet of code it's this code that you see right down here this style equals border inserting that just in front of this forward slash now this is this is the actual code taken from WordPress after I inserted an image this is what you would see if you clicked on HTML tag in the in the editor and so what you're looking for is the uh, the, the image source here's the image source here and it ends right here at this angle bracket and the, the area you're looking for is you want to be just to the left of this forward slash and what you're going to do is insert this little piece of uh, a little snippet of code in there and you see I've done that here just this is the same code down here and all I've done is, is paste it in that little snippet right here and and that that'll solve the problem now I'm going to show you a, a larger image of this little piece of code to give you a better idea what it looks like here's a blow up of the actual little snippet of code that you're going to place in and when you place it in make sure you include the quotation marks and uh, once you do that and you see I've got a this is just a tail end this is the uh, uh, exploded view of the tail end of that uh, uh, image source and uh, you see that I've pasted it in just to the left of the uh, forward angle bracket that marks the end of that uh, image tag Now back at the finished page, you can see that that border is gone and the image fits in there much, uh, much more clearly and that the distracting gray border is removed. Try this little trick. I think you'll really enjoy it. For more WordPress tips and techniques, or if you're looking for information to quickly build your affiliate blog empire, visit OneClickLearning.com. Have a great day.